A lot of streamers who play Fortnite use Unite Bot, which is a Discord bot, in order to manage their community and get people into custom games. But the setup can be a little complicated if you don't know exactly what you're doing. So in this video, I'm gonna walk you through all the steps you need to take in order to not only register with Unite Bot in a Discord server, but also to get the bot into your game and make sure that you get the right code and are able to get into the custom game. So let's jump into it. Okay, so I'm gonna show you exactly how to register and also get into our custom games. Uh, the first step, you only have to do one time, and that is register with UniteBot. So the first thing we're gonna do is join the Flock Discord. If you haven't done that already, make sure that you uh, get into our Discord. If you do exclamation point Discord in the chat over at twitch.tv slash EagleGarrett, you can get a link to our Discord. But we're gonna come into the uh, the Flock Discord here, click on it, and you'll notice that we've got message boards over here on the left side. We're gonna scroll down. We've got topics, and then underneath topics, we have custom games. And you'll see that we've got custom registration right here. I'm gonna click on custom registration. And the first thing that I wanna do is click this little, this little hand right here. Uh, it says your Epic account registration, please click on the raised hand below to link your Epic account. You will receive a direct message from Unite with further instructions. Please make sure to follow these instructions and the direct message. So I'm going to click this little hand right here and the Unite bot's going to pop up with a little message. Something to note, guys, is that if you're not receiving direct messages from UniteBot, it's probably because you have your direct messages turned off for our Discord. And so for any Discord that you're in, in this case, it's the Flock, you need to come up here and click this little drop down in the top left hand corner and then go down to privacy settings. And when you go to privacy settings, click on that and you'll see that allow direct messages from server members is an option here. You need to make sure this is turned on and not off. If it's turned off, that's the reason why you're not receiving any direct messages from UniteBot, and that would prevent you from being able to sign up and do all the other steps we've talked about. So make sure that's turned on, hit done, and then you should be good to go. It's gonna pop up with a little message. I'm gonna click on the UniteBot, and it gives us a little uh, link your Epic Accounts thing, and then it says we are now going to link your Epic Games account to your Discord account for the server The Flock. Please type in your Epic Account or Epic Games account name or paste your Epic Game account uh, ID. So we're gonna type in our name here. This is my wife's account here. So we're gonna do her account. I've already done mine, so I can't reshow you all this. So type in her Epic name and there we go. The name has been found. And then it's gonna ask you, please choose what you want to register by clicking the respective icon. We're gonna register on PC. Now, if you're on PS4 or Xbox, that should also pop up down here. Uh, but for us, we're on PC, so it's just giving us a couple different options, and we're going to click PC. There it goes. It's going to ask us what input method we want to use. We're on keyboard and mouse, so we're going to click keyboard and mouse. Of course, if you're on controller or anything else, you select that. We're going to say keyboard and mouse for us. And then it's going to say to send a friend request to Unite number four, which is their bot. So we're going to go over to our Fortnite game here. We're going to go to our friend request tab, and we're going to send a friend request to Unite and then space the number four. That's what it asks us to do. So we're gonna send that friend request and a little message is gonna pop up and say congratulations. And boom, they accepted our friend request instantly. Accepted our friend request instantly. So we're now gonna go over to our party and you're gonna see that UniteBot is in there and it gives us a code. Whatever that code is, whatever number that code is right there on your friend request list, that's what you wanna type in on Discord, 5905 for us. Now yours could be different. We're going to go back over to Discord here. Five is going to say type in the code. So we're going to say 5905 in Discord on that direct message that you have going with UniteBot. Then we're going to hit enter. All right, updating and it says complete. Once we've done this, we are officially registered for the customs uh, UniteBot that we're using in the, the Discord. So with that being said, this is all you have to do for the first step. Once you've done this one time, you don't need to do it again. Okay. So now for the second part, we're going to come back over here to the flock discord. And you'll notice that now that I've done that process, a new tab is opened up for me, the join custom games. I'm now, I now have access to join custom games. So the next thing I'm going to do is come down here into join custom games and it's going to go ahead and open up this and you can see where other custom games have been played. This shows everybody who's played the custom games and all that kind of stuff. So I'm going to scroll down the bottom here. And basically, whenever we do a, cu a custom game, we're going to send out the notification in this Join Custom Games tab right here on the left side of the screen. 
So, when one pops up, it'll look something like this. When we're actually performing a custom game, and you've already done the registration part right over here, you don't need to do this part again, you just need to come into this Join Custom Games and wait until a new game is started. So, let me show you what that looks like. You'll notice that a brand new custom matchmaking game pops up, and it says a new custom match has been opened, please click the hand to sign up for the match. Um, and then it'll, it'll tell you what game mode we're going to be in, how many players are going to be in the game mode, and the rules. And uh, so you want to look at these rules, make sure that you follow the exact rules for that particular customs game. And uh, to register, we're going to just click this hand button right here. So we click the little hand button, and that's all we have to do. And until the streamer passes out the, the code information, which is not actually a code, it's a, it's a bot, but I'll show you that in a minute. Until that direct message comes in right up here from UniteBot, then this is all you have to do. You just sit and wait, watch the stream, do whatever. Once that UniteBot sends a direct message, which should pop up right up here, you click on that and you follow the instructions. It says, good news, you've been selected to participate in the match. It says, first thing you got to do is accept a friend request from Unite125. So we're going to go over to Fortnite and friend requests, Unite125 send us a friend request. So we'll accept the friend request. There we go. So we've accepted the friend request. The next thing it says to do is please invite the bot to your party. So we're going to invite Unite125 to our party. And Unite125 has joined us right here. So then next we're going to do is we're going to click on them and make them the party leader. So we're going to hit manage and make party leader. All right. So we've made Unite Bot party leader. It's saying hold on for one second. And there we go. And then it says, please ready up. As soon as it leaves, you just hit play. As soon as it leaves, you hit play and you are good to go. That's all you have to do. And you're in. All right. Once you're in, once this countdown starts right here, that's all there is to it. You invited UniteBot to your lobby. You made it the party leader. It put the code in for you. And then when it leaves, you hit play. And that's all you have to do. Now you just sit and wait for the match to start. Once the match starts, then you'll be good to go. And as you can see, we're now in the match. We didn't have to do anything else except for hit play after UniteBot left. And there we are. We are in the game, ladies and gentlemen. And if you'll notice over here on your UniteBot direct messages, it says, it'll it'll tell you everything that's going on. It says first, uh, Unite125 is now your friend. So after you, you uh, accept the friend request, it says, uh, Unite125 is now in your party because it says, please invite to your party. So we invited him to our party. Then please promote to party leader. We did that. And as soon as you've done all that, it says, perfect. Your code is now set. Please ready up now. And we hit that ready up button. And uh, of course, it reminds us of the rules for the customs game. So this is how we ready up with UniteBot. Uh, it's a great feature because it allows us to also, if there's any griefers or cheaters, we can take them out of the games. And during the game, you can go over to custom games and you can see who's in the game like for instance it was just me this this particular game but you'll be able to see exactly who's in the game how many kills they've each had things like that if you're doing a fashion show then there should be no kills and you can see what what people are doing if somebody's cheating then we can go in and we can block them or things like that so once you've signed up every time a new custom game pops up it'll pop up under that join custom games you click the little hand and then you follow these exact same steps for each new game and there you have it that's all you have to do in order to get registered with UniteBot. So in our Discord server, which is the flock on Discord, we use UniteBot in order to do custom games. And uh, more specifically, we've been doing a lot of like Fortnite fashion shows and stuff like that. If you'd like to join us, feel free to come over to twitch.tv slash Eagle Garrett and jump in with us. We'd love to have you. Um, also, guys, I do want to remind you I'm on uh, other social media platforms like Twitter, a lot on Twitter. Instagram, I'm on there, and you can reach out to me on either one of those, and Facebook as well. So links for all of this stuff in the description of the channel. If you like the video, smack that thumbs up button. If you'd like to uh, see more videos like this, smack the subscribe button, and to know when they come out, smack that notification bell. Guys, have a great day. Rock on, peace out, God bless, and I'll see you in the next video. Okay. All right, what else we got? What do we, oh, this guy right here, this guy looks good. Get in. All right. <laughs> Bro, that guy tried to, he tried to shotgun me.